Kia ora, good evening. Robin Bain's brother has come to his defence, strongly rejecting the latest claims that Robin killed his family. In a rare interview, Michael Bain says there's an innocent explanation for marks on Robin's thumb and he wants to clear his name. He spoke exclusively to Simon Bradwell. Michael Bain wants to set the record straight about his brother Robin. But if Robin had ever been charged um, uh, with this uh, tragedy that uh, he would not have been found guilty because there was just no evidence against him. Michael Bain rarely gives interviews about the murders of five members of his family for which his nephew David Bain was convicted then acquitted. But he wants to rebut the latest claims from David Bain's supporter Joe Carum. I'm mainly concerned about Robin's reputation, really. Joe Carum claims photographs show marks on Robin's thumb, which were caused by loading the rifle used in the murders, proving Robin was the killer. There were no fingerprints of Robin's found on the murder weapon, and Michael Bain says any marks on his thumb are the result of developing a nature bush reserve for children at the local school. And that would have incurred scratches on his hands because he was clearing scrub and, and working with his hands on this bush reserve. And that isn't the only cause. Shortly before the tragedy had been engaged in fixing guttering on the house. The government's currently considering a compensation claim from David Bain. If there's any inference of Robin's guilt in the payment of compensation, then I, I believe it would be unfair. And Michael Bain says a report by former Canadian judge Ian Binney recommending compensation focused on hearsay, not facts. I was incredulous about it. Michael Bain is also angry that hearsay evidence that Robin and daughter Laniette were having an incestuous affair should never have been allowed at David Bain's second trial. We just don't believe a word of that uh, hearsay. And in fact, uh, the police then told me that they had no evidence of that at all. Michael so Bain says he's that. never doubted Robin's innocence and nothing in the new claims has changed his mind. Simon Bradwell, One News.